have some cherry wood beams for the project. We are back in Berlin with these nice beams of wild cherry and we'll now bring them in the workshop. After looking at these beams for quite some time and turning them around and looking at them, I decided that this feature here, that I like it a lot and I want to display it, so this will be the underside visible to everyone. And this will then be the upper side that won't be visible. And this part of the beam will stay in the shop for future projects. have some problems with the jointer not being sturdy and stable enough. It moved several times during the planning attempts of the first side here. So let's try something else and let's try to mount the jointer somehow to some bench. The planer is now fixed to the bench with ratchet straps and some wooden blocks as distance pieces and this is now very sturdy. I have marked where I will cut off the end of the beam. To secure this crack from further opening I will use butterfly keys. This used to be an edge plane, but it is unfortunately cracked as well. We can repurpose this material to make the butterfly keys to connect the wild cherry. The horn beam will stay very light in color, providing a nice contrast for the darker wild cherry. The next step is to precisely mark the outline of the butterfly key. Obviously the key can't move while we do this. 